Let's catch them up. With catch them all fishing with Zach. Ketchum. Look at this fish. Catch them up. Guys, the giants that we just caught. Joey, are you excited? Guys, so the giants, dude. guys. We would not have caught these fish without Ryan. It's scared all, oh, dude. Ryan, what's it? Ryan is fishing, Ryan right? Is fishing. Dude, amazing guy, a friend of mine for a long time, but we only have three fish and I wanted to do a catch and cook bass for you guys. You guys have been asking for it for a very long time. And Ryan. We shot the liver. We only have three. Can I go? You can go. Wait, wait. It's getting really windy out here, but <laughs> Ryan says he's gonna catch a fourth fish by hand. by hand in the culvert. Go ahead. Go ahead. Do what you gotta do. <laughs> okay. 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 We're gonna make it happen. What is this guy doing? I don't know. I don't know. What are you doing? You're a liar, bro. Lower your liar. Let go, let go, let go. Oh my god! Are you serious? There's no gator. What are you doing? Come on, come on, come on. Ah! What? No, no, wait, what's happening here? Oh my god. What did he put in okay? there? No, he put something in there. Like, how did you do that? How did you do wait, that? The, wait, that's it. Is it alive? Dude, there is There's a bass. There's a bass. Is this alive? Hello? Is he dead? Did you lie? Are you, is this for real? Are you breathing? Oh my god! Dude, it's. Are you kidding me? How did he do that? What's in there? Did you put something in there? Bro, Where is it? This is not clickbait. This is 100% real is South Florida largemouth bass. How did you do that? Should I do another one? Should I try to get another one? <laughs> Dude, okay guys, we're gonna do a catch and cook with that. <laughs> I have no word, bro. <laughs> I thought you were just gonna jump in like an idiot. Really, you really got it. <laughs> I thought you were fishing. Ryan. <laughs> Ryan is fishing. Dude, it's real. He really did that. He really did that, Joey. <laughs> Dude, guys, we caught some giants out here fishing with Ryan Escarado. What are you doing? What are you doing, dude? Oh my gosh. No swimming. <laughs> no swimming. Show you. Dude, this is insane. Oh my god. Dude. Oh my god. <laughs> so guys, we're out here messing around. Ryan just caught our catch and cook bass. Joey, could you hold this for a second? For you? Dude, no, 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 no. That's oh, the camera. Oh, my bad. My bad. My bad. You good? This is insane. What did he do? He blocked the hole, the rest of the hole with this? I think so. I think that's the whole point to kind of like maneuver it. Ryan is scared of guys. It's all on the magic YouTube, fingers. What's your YouTube channel name? Ryan is fishing. How did you and do security that? is about to kick us out. Okay, we need to go. <laughs> all right, bye bye. Have Ryan a good time. Fishing, guys, subscribe to Ryan is fishing. This is absolutely insane. Security is going to kick us out, but uh, maybe he won't. I don't oh, know. Okay. We're going to throw this guy in the cooler and uh, cook him up, I guess. Dude! That's this crazy, is, brother. This is ridiculous. Let's go see. Oh my god. What? How? Dude, I need that silver pipe. Ow! We're not grab that grass like this. We're ripping out. Is this a joke? We have to have set this up like this. Dude, how, how would that stay? Let me know. Let me know. I'm trying to figure it out. I'm a smart guy. This is just ridiculous. Let's check this out. Let's see if he's going to open it. That's a freaking live bass, bro. Oh my god. There's, yeah, he's fine. You really caught that right now. Yeah, that, Literally just caught that, guys. He doesn't have red lips or anything. Look, he's fine. Oh my god. That, that is ridiculous. How did you do that? Ryan is fishing, guys. Ryan is fishing. Ryan is fishing, guys. Yes, baby. <laughs> if that's real, that's a, I'm scared. Hey. Ryan is fishing, guys. Check out his channel. Subscribe to my man. Ryan is fishing, please. We're going to take that bass home now, and we're going to do a catch and cook with it. Guys, catch and cook bass. Where are you? 
Oh, I think this is him right here. This one? Yeah, the catch and cook bass is right here. You sure? I'm almost positive. Bro, we have a lot of bass. I'm almost positive, bro. This one right here. I'm pretty sure. That's him. That's him, the skinny one. This one? Yep. Oh, for sure. That's him. That's dinner, son. That's dinner, son. Alright, cool. Grab that bad boy. Alright. Okay, gotcha. Alright, gotcha, dude. Dude, let's go. Guys, I've never eaten a larger bass like this. I've eaten a lot of like really small ones, but never one about this size. So, watch your step right there. That's a pretty solid bass to eat. One. We just set this up really quick, guys. So we can have our holding tank because not only did we catch this bass, but we caught a larger one. So check this out. Let's see how she does. That's how she does. We're just keeping this one to eat. Remember, guys. This one had a little bit more stress because we took a thumbnail with her and stuff like that, but we're eating this girl, so she's fine. All right, cool. She's good to go, guys. What we're going to do now, she looks straight. It's a shame to eat bass, you know, but it doesn't matter because everyone eats it all the time all over the world, especially North America. That's like the biggest fish on the eating list aside from the panfish. So what we're going to do is we're going to just keep her here. As you guys can see, she's just doing great right now. She's fresh, fresh fish. But I really wanted to see what's inside her stomach, guys, because she was in a local pond that a lot of people fish. Right now, I'm going to show you guys the monster. He's sitting right here in the cooler, guys. We're not doing a catch and cook on this bass, however. We're going to try our best to keep it alive. We're a little bit worried about all these bass because they seem to have a lot of parasites on them. So if they have, like, too many parasites, we're just going to let them go and because we don't want to have, like, a pond full of parasites and every fish we put in there just parasites everywhere but we're gonna try to house these large bass they're very large breeder bass and we have one right here so let's check it out joey slam ladies and gentlemen youtube channel without him we would not have went up there with ryan iscara because i wasn't driving that far <laughs> check this out i'm not sure if you guys can see it's kind of dark right now they're over there. there's three bass in here joey's gonna show you the other two but i'm gonna show you the one that should be the next Shamu if she does all right and the parasites don't completely oh just cover us oh, up, dude. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. So we're gonna try to get him right now with the net. Just get him in the pot. Don't wanna hurt her anymore. Yes! Okay, come on. Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Run. Don't trip. Don't trip. I know I got my door to the Explorer shorts. Don't make fun of me. <laughs> all right. Check this girl out, guys. Check this. Girl. Oh, oh, that's all mouth. Look at the size of this bass. That's a solid unit, dude. Solid unit. It's a pretty fish. Pretty fish. That's yours all day. Dude. Yeah. I don't know. They're both pretty. Joey and I got a twin pair, guys. I'm not sure which is which, but who knows? They're both really big fish. And we're really happy to have them. Hopefully, she does all right. I'm going to keep her in here for a couple days. As you guys can see, though, there's parasites. Oh, actually, I don't want to lift her up again, but there's parasites all over. Let's see. She can do that on herself. I shouldn't even have to revive or anything. There we go. There we go, baby. We're going to see how she does. We're going to see if those parasites, like, overwhelm her and how she reacts to the new water. Because the new water and a little bit of that, what's that stuff that we always use? The okay. Melifix should get rid of the parasites and we should be able to keep this bass, unlike some of the other bass we had to release in the past because they were just too, too dirty. So... She looks great in there. In the bottom and the flow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Thanks, Joey, for Thank driving and catching up. Ollie, dude, monster, Joey's cameraman. And shout out to Ryan Esquerdo, guys. His channel link is down here, too, because without him, he put us on some big fish, big guys. Fish. We were just able to catch him. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. This bass is just tremendous. I think she's going to do great in there. We're going to go ahead and take out the water that we have to connect to the lake. And we're going to put some Melifix in there and try to get rid of the parasites. If we can't, we won't be able to keep her, you know. But if we can, then we're going to keep this bass. We're going to have a new Shamu, guys. So I hope you stay tuned for the next episode. It's going to be crazy trying to train this thing to eat in a smaller pond that we're going to build right over there, guys. Oh, yeah. That was a cool zoom. In. But uh, stay tuned to the next episode, guys. Joey slams out. And catch up. It's right there. No, 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 no. No, it ran away. It ran away. There's a snake, guys. There's a giant snake and it ran away. I don't know if I want to go down there, but I guess I will. Can you see him? Where is he? He's gotta be here. He's gotta be here somewhere. Where is that thing? Guys.
He was just sunbathing. Look at how much room is under here. Oh, there's some more room back there. What is that? There's like a bunch of stuff underneath this dock. No wonder they're staying under there. Dude. Can anyone see it? I can barely see the camera screen. I'm not sure if you guys can, can see it. But I can see that there's a lot of room under there. The snake is under there, 100%. 100% that snake is sitting right there somewhere. Unless he went in the water. Wait, is that him? Wait, is that him right there? You see that shiny stuff right in the center of the camera frame, guys? No. Hold on a second. I can't see him. Hold on. Let's see if we can see him in the water, guys. This is ridiculous. He was bathing right here. Like, literally, he started to creep up right here I guess I'm not sure if the water leaked or whatever because I have this whole situation going on right there but he was literally right here hold on I've been throwing a bunch of food and feeding the fish dude hold on guys hold on a second I know it's getting windy they let their dog out all the time on my neighbor's yard they let these big big old husky outside the thing is, if it was right here, you'd be able to see it, like, in the water. I don't know where it is. We gotta figure this out. I'm not sure how we're gonna do it, but Jacob's the man to do it to catch him. We're gonna, we gotta figure out how to get the snake first of all, and then if we do get it, I'm definitely getting this thing fed to Chandler's python. Or, I mean, sorry, Chandler's uh, king cobra, guys. I don't know. We're gonna figure this out together, guys. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to do that. I think it's a cool idea. We haven't seen Chandler in a long time, and Jacob is the man with the plan as far as Catching these snakes, this is so weird, man. I'm not sure how big that thing is, but it seemed like it was pretty big. I also have some giants that I've been feeding, and it turns out there's something new back here that you guys have no idea about. But we're gonna see it soon on the next episode, on the next episode, on the next episode. Oh, catch them all. Catch them all. Woo! Catch them all.